hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is cherry i am a single mom of four living in germany and at the same time working at the hospital as a registered nurse guys actually this video is not a um a year tutorial this is a new thing i come across in in youtube as you guys have seen you will see the, at the end of this video you're going to see the things i use to prepare this oil and I think it has helped me months ago. If you can watch so some of my videos, I, I was not even having ear here. So, but I'm using different things. And this time I decided to use this to see if it can help also, including what I have started using. Okay. I was not having ear. I lost all my ear in front of my head. But now the, my edges are much better than before when i started youtube channel so this is the oil it's my first time trying it but this video is not about this oil it's not about my ear it's not about it's something that i want to talk to you guys different different funny things you know but it stinks eh at the end of the day if you try it i don't know if it works if you are going to continue but it really stinks okay um let me go to the reason why i took my camera to film today we have a parable in my country in Sierra Leone that we used to say, if dog bets you, no better. If you better, una or tuna dog. It's like when a dog bites you, do not bite that dog. If you bite it, it means both of you guys are dog. So I'm the kind of person, I don't know how you hurt me. Like, I don't know how bad you did to me, whatever badly things you did to me. I will be angry like just a few days, few months, few weeks. Then I'm done. Like I'm done with it. You don't even need to come to me and say sorry. You don't even need to call me and say sorry. I will just forgive you easily. Just easy like that. I forgive people that really do bad things to me. Like the person that hurts me the most in my life, you know, I forgive them. But people used to tell me that cherry that the reason why people are hurting you that the reason why people are using you you forgive easily you take things easily it's not you're not supposed to be like that if somebody hurts you you should hurt that person again if somebody if somebody treats you bad you should also treat that person bad but i can't I wanted there are some times say, oh, you do this to me. I will tell you that I'm cherry. I will tell you that I can do this again. But I can't hurt a fly, guys. I can't hurt a fly. This is just me. I can't. Please, guys, this is thing that is bothering me. And but people are still seizing advantage of me. People are still doing things that they don't supposed to do because they know that I'm a very soft. Person, I have this soft heart. I can hurt somebody. They will still treat me as if I am a fool or as if I don't understand nothing. So, guys, please state it down in the comment section. Please. This is not a video, nice video, good. You say, please, I need help. Not that comment, please. I would like to see a comment where you guys will tell me what to do. Should I start returning bad to these people? Should I start in bed biting them because they are biting me? Should I start in treating them bad because they are treating me bad? Should I start in holding them on my heart because they are continuously doing bad things to me? Or should I continue to live the way, the way I'm living, the way I used to live, to usually forgive people no matter what they did, they do to me? Should I continue forgive them? Should I continue just take take things easy? Maybe or should I continue returning bad whatever whenever somebody did bad to me? Should I continue to do the same bad to them? Maybe if I start doing that thing, they will stop hurting me. Maybe if I start hurting them too in a in another different way, maybe they will they will stop to hurt me. I don't know. I'm so confused, but a lot is going on. People that have been used me before, they still, even though I forgive them, but they will still come and try and doing, and they, they will still come and do the same thing to me. And I don't know, at the 
are the people who said I should return back to them. I should whatever they did to me, I should do, I should do more to them. Are they correct, or should I continue just ignore ignore them? Should I continue just ignore them and carry on with my life, or should I change the way of living? I don't know. I'm confused. I don't want to. I don't want you guys to help me out here. Like this thing is really, really going out of hands. It's really going out of hands. People are still seizing advantage of me, and they think they know that uh, after one or two weeks, Cherry is calm. You don't even need to talk to her. She, you can see it from her that she is calm. Which advice do you people get from me? Have you ever going to what I'm going to on this matter? How do you solve your own with this type of people? How do you solve your own problem with this type of people? Please help a sister. You know, I will soon be 35. Like I usually said on all my videos, people are always using, they are always seizing advantage of me. People always used me for my kindness or because I'm a soft person. I am a very soft person. If only you hear when I'm talking, you would think I'm a very hard person. But I am not a hard person. This voice that you people are hearing like a man or whatever, it's just a voice that, you know, when you are a woman, you did everything for yourself. You have never had a man that is doing things. You are, I, I am the man for myself. I am the woman for myself. I am everything, you know. I am the only person, a part of my dad that gave back my dad and my mom. I am the only person that have built myself to this level where I am, you know. I think it helped me to be so hard by talking, but it doesn't mean... Me talking that hard, I'm a wicked person. No, it's just my way of talking. But I'm a very, very soft person. I can't hurt a fly. If you have gone through this same situation that I'm going through, what do you do? What have you done to stop your own? To stop people that use you? To stop people that take you for granted? To stop people that don't respect you? To stop people that, you know, they will hurt you and go and come back because they know you're going to forgive them? Please help me out. Should I continue to just give them their fears and forgive them and do my things or should I do something else? Or should I return some of the bad they did to me? Please. If you have watched this video, if you have watched this video up to here, I would like to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching, guys. You can see, okay, how soft it is. But it's smelling. I don't know. It's my first time of trying it. And uh, I've never had to all those people that use this glove and all these things to make to make ear to to you. I've never had them saying it's smelling. It's really smelling. Glove itself, it's something that smells. It stink. So I'm not talking about. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Since I'm single, I will be managing it like that. If I want to go outside, I'll put perfume. On my ear, and there are some people. If they hurt, there are some people. If they hurt you, and you didn't return anything to them, you didn't um, react, you didn't return the bad thing they did to you, then they would think that ah, she is afraid of me. Cherry is afraid of me. That the reason see, I have done this to her, I have done that to her, but she is not even minding me she's not even reacting you know she's so afraid of me but like seriously i'm the kind of person i don't i'm not afraid of nobody on this app i just since that i am in this country i my don't have a mother my parents are not here and i'm also a growing up woman i have my four kids 
I don't have nobody to run to. So that's the reason why some things I just see them and ignore them. Not that I'm, I, I'm afraid. I'm not afraid. You know, but now some of them, they will still go and say, ah, she's so afraid of me. She's afraid of me. You can, I can do her whatever I want to do to her. She will not even return back to me. She will just be quiet and all this stuff. But I'm not afraid. I just want a peaceful mind. What the reason of me fighting somebody? And uh, what the reason? What the reason of me fighting you? Why? Because you you steal my money or you take my things or because you took things that I didn't give to you. You take them in your own way that you think you are civil. You think you are more clever than me. So I should fight you? Or... Oh. There is something I discuss with you, or oh, you know, because I I loved you, or you know, I loved you, or I like I liked you. You think I'm afraid of you? That is why I'm not reacting. No, I'm not afraid of you. I'm not just afraid. I just I'm just doing this because of peace, just for peace sake, just for peace sake, guys. I'm the kind of person. Maybe when I was young, I'm not afraid of problems. But now that with this age, like, I just want a happy life, you know. And uh, I've learned no one can give me this happy life that I wanted. No one can ever give me my happy life. I have to give it to myself. I have to give myself happy life. So, by me reacting to some of... So some people that, that are hurting me by me reacting to them, I don't think even God to God's side, it's not something good. Just forgive people that hurt you. So I don't know, but how long am I going to forgive people that always hurt me? How long am I going to be forgiven? How long? How long am I going to forgive people that always hurts me and they will come again and i will accept them again this is so crazy guys this is really crazy so please if you come across this video you know me you don't know me please put your own thoughts how to treat this type of people that always bully me how do you people want me to be treating them back so that they can stop bullying me please don't forget to put your own thoughts help me out okay i love each and every one of you guys please if you come across my video subscribe to my channel don't forget to while subscribing don't forget to put the um the notification bell on and yeah feel free to join my family i'm a single mom of four living in germany and at the same time working at the hospital and um yeah i talk a lot in my channel i talk everything i talk about single mother i talk about my kids i talk about nursing i talk about my religion i talk i do cooking in my channel so in my channel i have it all whatever you are looking for it's here on cherry's diary love you guys bye